Hi guys, my name is Genesis, I go by Jenny, and today I want to share with you guys how I was prescribed Phentermine. I am no longer taking it anymore, I am 9 months pregnant, I'm actually going to be 39 weeks tomorrow, and well, all my Phentermine videos have been pretty popular, and I still get questions over and over on how... I was able to get it, like where you can buy it, and I want to tell you guys how I was prescribed it. Um, not everyone is able to get their hands on this and there are strict doctors out there. So I'm going to tell you guys a little bit more. If you guys want to know more, keep on watching. So the very first time I was prescribed Phenermine was over three years ago now. I went to a new doctor that I had never been to before. I asked for the Phenermine. She was almost not willing to give it to me. She only gave me, I think, 15 milligrams uh, or... Yeah, it was really a small amount because I think the full one is 37.5. So I remember it was about half. She told me that she had stopped prescribing this medicine because one of her patients actually had a stroke from it. Um, apparently she had high blood pressure. I don't know if this doctor knew that at the moment when she prescribed it, but some doctors don't, you know, test you for all these different things they're supposed to, which I didn't get tested. When my sister got prescribed her medicine, she got tested a, like a lot of different things. Um, but in this case, because it was so low, the doctor decided not to test me for anything and I was young, so... I mean, I'm 20, 27, I just turned 27, um, like three days ago. So, I'm now 27, and at that moment, I was probably, oh, damn, maybe 23, 24, right? So, to her, I was young, and it was fine. So, she told me she was only going to prescribe it one time. And technically, everyone's allowed three prescriptions in a year, but because she was afraid to do it in the first place, she told me she would only give me one prescription. She wanted me to go back and get checked out by her, but I decided not to since I was only going to do it once. And I found another doctor who was willing to prescribe me a lot more. This doctor also did not do any lab work. Um, which they normally do but I think because I had already taken 15 milligrams and I did fine and I actually lost weight with that first um, prescription so she prescribed me the 37.5 milligrams but I did not take the whole thing um, if you guys have seen my other videos you know that I cut my pill in half I just can't do a full pill it's too strong for me um, there are symptoms like side effects and I they just are too strong so if I take half I feel a lot better and it'll actually last you twice as long so um, so you're originally only allowed to have it for three months in a whole year but if you cut the pill in half it's basically six months it sounds like a lot but you're only taking half of it when it's the same thing as if you took the whole pill in three months so basically because I take it for longer and slower it like the weight loss actually stays off so that's another thing so this doctor did not test me but I did fine on it um, there are a lot of things that can go wrong and normally this is prescribed by a doctor I did not get tested but I do know that the doctor will not prescribe you the medicine at least the doctor that I know. For the most part, doctors will not prescribe this medicine if you have anxiety, any signs of depression, um, high blood pressure, anything that could affect your heart because this medicine is very strong and dangerous. A lot of people are out here trying to sell it and people are trying to buy it. That's I would not recommend buying it off the street or anywhere else. Um, I've heard other countries sell it and you don't need a prescription and I don't recommend that at all. Um, a lot of places can like cut the medicine and put other stuff in it 
and that's just very dangerous um, you don't know what you're getting if you go somewhere else besides the doctor where I would get my medicine is from Safeway and they actually had a discount for me I don't know why if they give it to everybody or, or what but if you ask you might get it also I would only pay $20 for my prescription and it lasted me like I said what two months so it was pretty cheap I would also if you're taking it don't drink any caffeine that's what my doctor told me and I stopped drinking soda which probably helped me lose weight you know because I used to drink a lot more and so I cut out soda I cut out coffee which I don't always drink coffee but you know it has caffeine so mixing too much caffeine and the medicine can give you like heart palp palpitations it just doesn't feel good so I know me when I take caffeine with it it was bad um even taking the whole pill was just too much for me so definitely be honest with your doctor if you are someone with anxiety it's it'll be scary because you will feel symptoms and I do feel like I'm an anxious person just a little bit it does run in my family so that's where I kind of like was risking it the benefits of this medicine outweighed my risks because I was you know overweight well still am but more and it was just better for me to lose weight than to you know keep gaining weight and um, it pushed me to work out so I did end up you know becoming more of a healthy person not just by taking it I did exercise and I also did eat a lot better um, the medicine helps you not crave food as much so you it's a little bit easier to give up other foods that are bad not everybody will be prescribed this medicine it's not for everyone it's not a magic pill either you do have to put in the work and I've tried taking it again ever since then I think two more times and it was not the same I think once your body has had it it's it's kind of used to it in a way um, or unless because I tried a lot harder the first time the second and third time that I've tried it I think I think it's been two other times it just did not work the same so I do recommend to drink a lot of water try and exercise eat early and try to eat better and eat smaller meals and you should see results um, but not everyone's the same so keep that in mind if you guys have any questions comment down below like subscribe and I will see you guys next time